We're getting gas in Virginia. It's been, what, five hours driving? No, no. This is our second stop. Just second stop for gas. First stop to use the restroom. We have the birds here. I have one small travel cage and a really tiny cage. Got peaches yeah. in there. Do you have yellow gum in the car? No. You want yellow gum? I have green. And blue Gatorade. We have blue Gatorade. Monday and we just came out the hotel I didn't get to like or the motel whatever motel and we are in Virginia borderline Tennessee we're like two miles away from Tennessee so we drove from New York all the way down to Virginia close to Tennessee and yeah I got my little coffee from the motel what an eventful night though the drive was good the bird came out the cage, and when we walked into the hotel room, because we went to IHOP, which was not too far, she was <laughs> she was literally flying in the hotel room. I was like, "Are you serious, girl?" Anyway, what's that? That's Lola. Say hi, guys, to the vlog. Hi. Lola. Lola, what are you, Mama? <laughs> and the birds, they're good. Holly's back there setting everything up it, it was a good trip plus we had the storm in new york we did get caught in it for like maybe five ten minutes in new jersey it wasn't bad it rained pretty much we drove about 10 hours tomorrow today uh we're gonna drive another 10 hours and then tomorrow we'll have like maybe four or five hours left and then we'll be already in texas hopefully we did pack this to the max so the car is a little low but we noticed that on like a lot of um trucks and vans and pickup trucks it's, it's kind of the same like it's low you're putting weight so it's, it's gonna be low a little bit you know so i'm saying you know anywho so wish us luck my arms are hurting my tripod's in the car i didn't bother to take it out okay. babe we gassed up three times last night right three times we we gassed up so now we're gonna Fill up the gas again. One, the beginning in New York, once in Delaware, and once in Virginia. So it's three Phillips, and now we're gonna fill up again. And gas prices it does get lower once you get down south, but it's still expensive. Wonder who did that. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it right there. Okay, if you know you know you don't. You should know. <laughs> All right. My arm is killing me. So let's go inside. Sorry if uh, I didn't keep you guys posted. I was, I was just so tired yesterday. Okay. So, quick update, we are in Arkansas. We're like six and a half hours away. We're taking pictures. Just stop for a minute to uh, stretch our legs. Let me take a picture of my children. Lola, sit down. 
So, how are you guys feeling? Good. Good? Good? We're almost there. Lola. <laughs> Daddy's in the bathroom, Daddy. He did? But he's a boy. Who wants to go in there? Like, females don't want to go in there. Boys are easy. Look at these kids. They're hilarious. I feel good. Excited. But driving all that, you feel good? Yeah, today I feel better. Yes, it was. Yesterday was rough, but we got off to a late start. Yeah, and we didn't get good rest the night yeah. before. But today, nah. Today I feel good. Yeah. Okay. Right, stop soon. Get these kids some dinner and rest. Yes. Let's and go sit over there. Home tomorrow. Yes, we'll home, home tomorrow. tomorrow right? What's home? Texas. Say it again? Texas. Hey. <laughs> Can you go in there? No, look at that. It's hot. Layla had makeup on in the back seat of the car. Mm -hmm. That was yeah. that was funny. How was that bathroom trip? It was clean. Really? Really yes. clean. Oh, okay. Surprising. All right, I don't <laughs> like using porta potties. I mean, when you have to, you know, go for it. All right, let's take, let's drive a little bit more. Let me give you a check in with the, with my animals. Look at, <laughs> Mama. They're doing so good, right? That's just a travel case, guys. I do not use that. She has a mansion of a house. All right, look, look at this look dog. Look at, look at, look at. <laughs> oh, look at All right, let's continue the road. Hours left, right, babe? Two hours exactly. Two hours exactly, and we're already in Texas. Super excited. I can see my mom and my dad and my brother. Uh, they've been out here for about a month. Maybe a little over a month already. Oh my gosh. I encountered a cicada. Cicada? How do you say it? Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you know I'm from the city, right? That is hilarious. Okay. A cicada went into our hotel room because our, our motel room. Miguel, be careful. There's. Went into the hotel room, motel room. And then Hubby was trying to get it out. I don't think he succeeded. I ran out because I didn't want him to try to like scoop it out of the room and then it'll come flying onto me. So when we left this morning, the sun was uh, rising, so uh, <laughs> and I, I researched a little bit. Sometimes they do come out, um, huh? Oh, how cute! My daughter is walking the dog, and it says dog restroom over there on that little sign. I don't think you guys can see that. So cute. Anyway, so Hubby tried to get the cicada out of the hotel. So it's like one of oh, motels. I keep saying hotel. It's like one of those motels that everything is outside. Like, you know, your door is outside. The one we stood in the first night, it's like like a hotel. Like you're going inside of the uh, motel. Anyway. So he was trying to get it out. And since I left, because I got scared and I ran into the car. Because Hubby was like, you abandoned ship. You abandoned ship. And I'm like whatever a cicada came in with me into the car can you believe that came in with me <laughs> i had to open the door lower the window it came right out but still that is ugly nasty gross i can't even deal so they do like come off the trees like during dusk or dawn so that's probably what happened you know, the sun wasn't even fully up yet. So anyway, wanted to share that story with you guys. I am not a fan of bugs and insects, but whatever. I mean, 
mean, I can deal with them. It's just I'm not a fan. I mean, who isn't, right? Who loves bugs? I mean, well, no, there are people who actually have a roach colony. Can you believe that? Uh, uh, what you call it? Like a cage full of... <laughs> I'm super tired, you guys. Um, woke up at like 5.30 on the dot. Hi. And, um... Google Scott! Google Scott! <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. And this blanket that we have, it's giving off like a, all this. You see it? Oh my okay. gosh. It's a comfortable blanket, but I think ever since I washed it, because it's a new blanket, I washed it and then all those little bolitas came out of everywhere. Layla, are you happy you're in Texas? Yay! I'm tired. I need a nap. Now we have to unload this later when we get there. I, I probably won't you. vlog too, too much. But I just wanted to do a little, little vlog for you guys. Um, you know, and then something I can look back on. I keep looking at myself because, you know, I can't help myself because it's weird. Like, you're looking at the camera, but camera, that's you guys. I'm looking at myself. <laughs> All right. So my arm is hurting again, and I will talk to you guys soon. I'll see you folded. It's exciting, nerve-wracking, uh, but yeah, it's gonna be great. Thank you guys for taking the time to watch. Uh, stay tuned. I don't know if this will be the ending of my vlog, but we shall see. Blah blah blah. Catch you guys later. Bye.